Hey guys, it's Alexis. Welcome back to my channel. So today, I already started like making the Halloween costume, but I just realized I should film this and it could be my video for tomorrow. So I am DIYing my Halloween costume. Um, I'm gonna be a Hydra flask. I know. Um, my sister's gonna be a Rubik's cube. Don't ask me. We just thought of these. So I already started like making the costume, but we went to the craft store and. I bought a big sweatshirt, and I bought like a fabric marker, or a sharpie, big huge sharpie, and fabric paint, and I bought patches for like stickers on the hydro flask. So I'm going to show you making my costume now, and maybe making my sisters. Okay, so I started making it, here's like the big huge sweatshirt, it's really big. I started drawing hydro, and when I thought of making this video, so I just have this big sharpie that I am writing hydro flask on, and then... This is what I'm using, my sister's Hydra Flask. Um, I gotta try to make that logo with that Sharpie. Or, we also bought some paint. Um, which I might use for the logo, but it might be easier to use a Sharpie. So yeah, I'm gonna get doing this. Okay, so I finished Hydro Flask at the bottom. I kind of really messed up on the K, and I kind of messed up on the R right there. The K's I'm just not good at, and I kind of like totally tilted it. But everything else looks okay. Um, so now I'm going to have to put the actual logo right here, which will probably take me 10 years. But you know, whatever.
zoomed in. Okay. So I finished the entire shirt. So down here it says Hydro Flask and the little logo. What I did is I um, cut out a piece of paper with the logo on it. Or I guess I printed it and then cut it out. And then I sharpied, used a sharpie to outline everything. It's a little messed up on there. And then I just added in some fabric paint in the middle. So yeah, this is my outfit. Now I have to put patches on it. Okay. So now I have a bunch of patches to act as like stickers on Hydrofask. So I have this one, sorry it's like down, um, a little heart and a poop emoji. And I have this one with the watermelon and the lemon. Then I have this one that says wow. Then I have this little cactus plant. Then I have this three pack of an Instagram logo, a space thing, and a panda. And I have this three pack that's this cool cupcake and ice cream. So I need to figure out where I'm going to arrange them all. And then we're going to glue them on. Not actually iron them. Okay. So I need to figure out where I'm going to put them all. I'm not quite sure. They're all going to be on the front. Um, I just need to figure out where on the front they're going to be. Okay, we got all of our patches done and out, so I just need to figure out like where they're going to go and then I'll glue them on. I think this is the final way I'm going to put them all. I like it. So now it's time to hot glue them all. So this is the finished product. It looks really good. I found all the things from the craft store. I didn't get the hot glue gun from the craft store because I hot glued all these down. But um, you can find it there. I got the sweatshirt, the paint, the Sharpie, and the patches. So I'm not sure if I explained to you, but I wrote the outside of the Sharpie and then painted with fabric paint in the inside. It doesn't look the best, but it looks great. So yeah. Also, if you um, it is a sweatshirt type thing. Not like a hoodie, it has no hood. But yeah, this is really fun and it's really easy to make at home. So I definitely recommend trying it out. So this is the final product and I did have to get a really big sweatshirt um, because I wanted it to be big for the thing so it looks like a hydroplast so this is it it didn't take much time at all and i don't and i think it looks pretty realistic
subscribe down below. Turn the subscribe button, correct? Also, if you want to do this, go ahead. It was really easy and really simple. And I did it all DIY. And there was like no uh, tutorial on how to do this. I just did it all myself. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And enjoy the rest of your day, guys. And have a good Halloween. Bye. And I